Welcome to the video Vort. When Leah has her fourth and final child, she names him Yehuda, and she exclaims, Hapam Oda Es Hashem. Now I will give thanks, express my gratitude to Hashem. The name Yehuda, the word Ode, all come from the same root, meaning thanks or gratitude. Now the rabbis in Masechus Brachos teach that from the day the world was created, until, the, until Leah came along, no one expressed gratitude to God. Is that possible? It's inconceivable. Not the Imahos, not the Avos, no one expressed gratitude. So the Mayana Shel Torah cites a beautiful idea that the word Hoda'a actually has two meanings. One means gratitude or gratefulness, but the other means an admission of some sort. To be Moda means to admit. And here Leah was admitting something. She was admitting to Hashem that not only the good in her life was good, but even the tough times, the bad, was also good. See, Leah had pain and anguish and suffering, and she had a difficult, uh, difficulty in her relationship with Yaakov Avinu in her station as his wife. She had tough times, but she connected the dots and saw that that rocky road, that broken road was the necessary one to get her to the ultimate beautiful conclusion of being the mother of literally one-third of the Shvatim of Klal Yisrael. And that's what the rabbis meant. That until Leah, no one expressed the thanks for the bad. They only expressed thanks and gratitude for the good. We all have tough times, we all have uh, rocky, rough patches. Uh, but the trick of being a Jew, a Yehudi, is to express gratitude not only for the good, but Gamzu Latova, to express gratitude and faith that even in the bad, there is some good that will be produced. May Hashem bless us with a smooth road, but when times are tough, He should give us awareness of the good that the tough times can bring. Good Shabbos.